In this video, we're going to describe the digital representation of sound in terms of sampling resolution and also talk about sampling rate and the Nyquist theorem. There are two major factors that affect the quality of any digitally converted sound wave, and that's the sample rate, that's the speed or frequency of capture, and the sample resolution, and that's the level of detail the sound is captured in each time it is sampled. So more precisely, sample rate is how frequently the amplitude of a sound wave is recorded. The more often a sample is recorded or captured, the smoother the playback will sound. The number of samples per second is measured in hertz. A typical audio file is recorded at 44,100 hertz. In other words, 44,100 samples being captured per second. Here we can see the sampling rate doubling from 3 hertz to 6 hertz. In other words, the analog signal is being captured six times per second instead of three. Sampling resolution is how many different gradations of amplitude can be represented in a digital waveform. So this is the amount of data stored with each sample, and we measure it in bits. Most modern digital recordings are captured in higher quality either 16-bit or 24-bit sample resolution. At 16 bits, each sample takes up two bytes and can store any one of 65,536 different amplitudes. At 24 bits, this increases to three bytes per sample, but being able to store up to 98,304 amplitudes. Here we can see the resolution doubling from 2 to 4 bits. In other words, each time the analog signal is captured, it can differentiate between 16 distinct amplitudes instead of only 4. In 1928, Harry Nyquist theorised that to produce an accurate recording, you needed to use a sampling rate at least double that of the highest frequency in the original signal. This theory was proven by Claude Shannon in 1949. The normal hearing frequency range of the human ear is between 20 to 20,000 Hertz. And this is why most professional audio records are sampled at 44,100 Hertz. Having watched this video, you should be able to answer the following key questions. What is the difference between sample rate and sample resolution? And what is Nyquist theorem?